Good morning, thanks for coming back to my channel. This is just a really quick update video. I'm just gonna to talk to you about a few things. Number one, as you probably know, if you follow me on social media, I have been nominated in the running awards for the best blog, and that is based on all these video blogs that I put together. I'd really appreciate it if you could vote for me in the final. Uh, voting closes on the 15th of March. I need as many votes as I can get if I'm gonna stand any chance of winning, because I'm up against really strong competition. Please go to therunningawards.com I'm in the publications and online section under blog personal and then Bayes 187 and click vote. You just have to register with your email just before you do that as well. So if you could vote, that would be really appreciated. Thank you very much. Secondly, obviously I'm still an ambassador for the Milton Keynes Marathon. That's coming up in 11 weeks. Now I just did a tweet today just to say to people that 11 weeks to go, if you haven't quite got through the training you wanted to do, maybe you're a little bit behind schedule and you're feeling like you're under trained, you perhaps haven't done enough miles, that kind of thing, and you're worrying. Don't worry, don't panic, okay? 11 weeks is still plenty of time. Um, I would suggest that you just get the training plan that you were following and whatever it says where you are, just get onto that week and do that week. Don't try and make up any miles that you've missed because where people go wrong, like, oh, I was meant to do 20 miles last week, so I'll do 20 extra miles this week. No, 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 don't do that, <laughs> because you will overtrain. Um, and if you overtrain your body, you'll injure your body, you'll never make the start line, let alone the finish line, okay? So just get back on the plan where it is and do the miles it says to do. Don't look back, forget those miles, that those weeks have gone now, okay? Um, so get yourself back on track as soon as you can and you'll be fine. I'm also happy to say that Ben Smith from the 401 Foundation has kindly invited me to race at his upcoming event, the 401 Festival of Running. And um, what I'll do is I'll put a link below to that, but that's coming up later in the year. And um, it's a whole weekend down in Portishead where you can do several races within the weekend. So on the Saturday, there's like, I think it's a a 5k in the morning and a half marathon a sort of afternoon time and then there's a music festival that night and then the next day you can do a 10k race in the morning and then there's a, like a 6.1k I think it is in the in the afternoon and that rounds up your whole weekend to a marathon so if you do all four races you get a you have to obviously pay per race you can do it that way and just do one just do two just do three whatever you want to do but if you do all four as a package you get four finishers medals and a bonus medal so it's a really good little package I'm, I'm delighted to be able to have the opportunity to do this event and I'm really looking forward to it and I hope as many of you um, will sign up and see me down there and of course profits from this race are all going to go and support the 401 foundation which is the charity Ben Smith set up after he did his 401 marathons in 401 days so Absolutely brilliant race, brilliant cause. I'm looking forward to that one. And last but not least, I have got a new website and I'm very pleased to finally have a website because I've wanted one for a long time. Um, I felt like I've got Twitter where I've got followers and I've got Instagram followers and I've got Facebook likers and I've got YouTube subscribers and all these people that we're, we're all probably got loads in common, we're all into running, could all get on really well, but I just felt like I had a party over there, a party over there, a party over there, and all these people would probably get on really well. So I'm hoping that this website is like a, a landing platform to bring all of those things together um, and everybody can share ideas and, and you know talk about races and that kind of thing. Um, so it's bays187.com. To get this website done, I don't know how to make a website. I'm not that technical. The FOD runner, Andy, you'll find him on YouTube, the FOD runner, Forest of Dean it stands for. Uh, he's also got a really fab YouTube channel that I watch all the time. He goes out running in the Forest of Dean, which is really scenic. And he knows his stuff as well when it comes to training. He just talks about training plans that he's following and there's lots of good tips there. But he's also a web developer. So, I mean, I've got talking to him through YouTube. I found out he's a web developer. And I just thought, you know, who better to make a website for me about running than someone who's also a runner and he's just going to get what I'm trying to do with it. So Andy has sorted that out for me. Uh, it's been absolutely amazing. Um, so I'd really appreciate if you could pop over to his YouTube channel and subscribe to him as a thank you to him for helping me with my website. That would be amazing. Um, and I'll link the website below. Please go and take a look. Um, it, it's in early days. Obviously, I've only just made the website, um, so I don't have loads of content on there. But it's going to be a work in progress going forward. And, you know, I'm just going to look to to improve and Andy's going to be giving me tips and hints along the way and how I can improve my website and we'll just see how it goes it's, it's a bit of a new thing all right so that's it it's just a bit of talk to camera today I've got I've got quite a few good races coming up over the upcoming weeks so I'm going to be doing the London Landmarks Half Marathon which is an inaugural race it's never been done before 
Um, so I'll be checking that one out, telling you what I think about it, showing you the route. Um, so please subscribe if you want to see those sorts of videos coming up in the future. If you've liked this video, please give it a thumbs up. Thanks for watching. See you on the next one.